Mass Effect Andromeda. Haven't played this in a long time. Almost like half a year, probably. I don't know. No, it couldn't be. No, no, no. No, that was the, that was the last time I recorded this. It was like a few several weeks ago since I did. But we're gonna see if we can do anything else on this on with this character and see what else happens. If not, then we'll just go kill things just for the hell of it and just roam around just for you know, like I said, just like a nanosecond ago. All right, let's land this baby like a little butterfly. I want it nice and easy, nice and smooth, especially by the tips. I don't want any vibrations. Just thought it'd be cool to have like a brighter red this time so you can actually see the color a lot better other than just the original one we had back then. Because, because with the original one, like the one I always used to have, the, the blood one, the blood red, you could just barely see anything. And you just, you needed the sun reflections to basically show the colors more. Whereas if you're in the darkness, it just doesn't really show as much, obviously. So this bright one, this solid red, is just perfect for the idea. I kind of like Eos. Could be Stockholm Syndrome. Oh, bugs! All right. Nice work. Oh, ho, ho. I never even tried this shotgun out. This is like the first time, and I already love it. Let's target practice. Target practice. It's so amazing! It's so amazing! It's awesome! All right, back in the vehicle. We're gonna hunt for some rabbits. Oh, there's two of them! Oh, fuck you, battery. Yoo-hoo! Yoo-hoo! Nice! Good jump. Let's try the other one. Yeah! No! No, 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 no! Come on, come on! You can do this! Come on, baby! You can do this! You can do this! Yes! Yeah! Yoo-hoo! That was nice! Pathfinder, the trap you set in the cargo bay, we got blip. I think something's in there. Really? Salmon? Hi there. You must be the one eating all our cereal. It's okay. No one's going to eat you. <laughs> you know, Pathfinder is supposed to catalog all new life forms. I should find you somewhere safer than our cargo bay. We'll find you a world with lots of plants and let you go. How about that? Guess everybody around here needs a home. Oh, Vetra, what you doing? Suvi, gotta love her, but those green snack things she's making for Liam's movie night? Let's just say they're probably better suited to throwing at the screen. You've got a better idea? Yeah, actually. Cora lent me an initiative access code so I could track down some contraband. Long story short, Someone on Kadara Port has popcorn. Oh. And Grexen, which is like your popcorn, only better because I can eat it. Someone smuggled popcorn across galaxies? It's light and people would pay big credits for it. Why not? Fair enough. I could track some down the next time we're there. Thanks. It'll be nice to have a treat out here, you know? Oh, yeah, I'm still trying to look for stuff for the movie nights. Been trying to find lots of things just to set up the biggest, the very first and big movie night that anyone has ever seen. Parkour. Maybe that's what we can do. We're gonna set up the movie night. Oh! 
Oh, I'm gonna screenshot that. Now orbiting Katara. I'm gonna screenshot that after this. Too bad Star Wars doesn't look like this. Oh, we just skipped the rest of the intro. <laughs> I didn't even press anything. That was hilarious. Hey, how's it going? Something extra. Don't mind the dirt. Okay. I'm just looking for popcorn. Popcorn, popcorn, popcorn. No. No. Oh, snacks! Got it! And uh, I wonder what else we need. What else would you need? Maybe drinks? Yeah, maybe drinks, actually. I could bring, like, baskets with wine, if anyone likes that. I prefer tea, personally. I got the popcorn and whatever Graxon is. Thank you. I owe Cora for letting me use her clearance. This will be fun, like watching vids with Sid when she was little. Liam's idea about watching vids together. Movie night? He delayed again, out of respect for the Krogan. Mm, good. From what I've seen, your vids are flat. They're only seen and heard. Angara vids use uh, tiny electrodermal signals. You feel it through your skin. Oh. I spoke to Gil. We have time to rig up a system to mimic it. If we can acquire the right components. Oh, that's, that's amazing. So like, basically 3D. Just in real life this time, like a real life experience. But is it, is it safe though? Does it, does it, are there any, um, any, any physical or mental side effects to it by any chance? Because of different experiences for some, any individual's, um, personal safety against technological distortions, so to speak? Would that be safe for not and Gar? I think so. Gil will be happy to test it. The components we need should be sold on IR. Let's be vigilant. Okay. All right. Out of destination. Next step, find the components. For the 3D modules. Land this baby like a butterfly, as usual. Ooh. Still good. Oh, decryption key, that's what we need. Let's just take it all. Yes, we got it! Oh, I'm so happy here. I wish I could actually live here. Ah, you acquired the components? Yes, I'm looking forward to seeing what you and Gil put together. He's very gifted. If, when we succeed, more of your people can experience our stories as they are meant to be enjoyed. Goda Tavitara. The Lulia Reborn Trilogy. I'm weeping a bit already. I hear Liam's planning to show some vids. If our duties ever give us time. Explains why Dragon PB are distilling something unsavory. Screw up the measurements and bathtub huge can leave you blind. Or worse, we can do better. Better how? An Asari liquor called a Kantha. They used to run these wonderful black and white ads. There might be a bottle on the Nexus. That's what I was hoping for. Let's get some liquor, baby. I'm about to find all kinds of shit. All right, gonna get some liquor, gonna get some wine, gonna get some beer, gotta get some tea, gotta get some water just to keep sober. I could make a song out of that, that should be a lyric.
There we go. One bottle of acantha, barely opened. It's medicinal, you understand. Cuts down hangovers, which will save PB and Drax some grief. I say, let's enjoy a few movies. And everyone else says, no, let's have an extravaganza with all the trimmings. You're complaining? No. Well, maybe, because now I need to do it all justice. You got me a decent library, but I heard someone has a director's cut of Last of the Legion. The band version. Remastered. No crappy extras added for the Hannah. And you want me to look for it? It'd be the gold-dusted cherry on your Sunday. In the meantime, I'll get things set. We're more than ready for a night in. Alright, it shouldn't hurt. That shouldn't be a pain. Got something I think you'll love. Last of the Legion. This is what you wanted, right? Wait, you actually found it. That version's practically a myth. I'll tell everyone to grab food. Jarl and Gil said they can rig something up in your quarters. If you need a minute to clean up, no problem. Just hit the console when you're good to go. Alright. It's the moment of truth. Let's call the team in. So let's call the gang in. They need you, Jorax. I know you left the Legion. I never left the Legion. They left me. But I know my duty. Alright folks, we can sit through a training montage with what many critics describe as excessive Turian flexing. No such thing. There really is. <laughs> or we can fast forward to a ship crashing into an asteroid crashing into a moon. Fast forward to the crash. Ah, oh, montage. Uh, Don't uh, cut bits out. I'd go for the crash. Let's just go Falling through the whole the thing. Scene, going once, Wait, I go for, let's going go through the whole twice. thing. Just go through the whole thing. Skip to the good stuff, Leah. Boo! Oh, even my character disagrees. It's a vacuum. The ship explosion would be silent. I hope that's not the voice of experience talking. Guess they wanted their money's worth. They actually blew up the derelict for that shot. Too bad the script wasn't caught in the blast. <laughs> Let's see, you're awesome. My team will hit the enemy cruiser, General. Force is the only thing fanatics understand. Why a strike team? Torpedo the cruiser! That's overkill. Get one engineer aboard, cut life support and engines, problem solved. And leave them stuck on a hostile ship? One torpedo, over by lunch. Uh... Let's try... For either sensors, spacewalk on the hull, cut life support, repel in, and take the hostage. Done it. Less exciting than it sounds. Seriously? Got the scars to prove it. Huh. I assumed you'd got that falling off a bastard. <laughs> <laughs> Speaking of, time for another round. Anyone for a Baron's jaw? Or are you euphemistically delicious? Wait, lesson. Rats. No! Oh, yeah. He was a sidekick. They die like goldfish. Not all of them. Like overacting. Even Ryder could do better. Oh, if jeez. I to. Oh, seriously? I, I don't know. I can do that. I'm You're not... wrong, Cora. No, he couldn't. <laughs> Thanks, baby boy. Come on, show us. I'll be no, dead for you. <laughs> I, I don't know about this. Okay. I don't know. <laughs> no, I'm usually not very good at acting. I don't even know what to, what to choose from. Normally it's like a two-choice thing, but... Yeah, it's, yeah I knew it was only a choice. Uh... It'll be avenged. Oh, Callum. I swear. Callum, please, not now. Not when we're so close. <laughs> Ryder, you must go on. It won't end this way. There's no justice in this galaxy. But there will be. Thanks, thank you all so much. Thank you, audience. It's been a pleasure entertaining it. Do me next. <laughs> sure thing, baby. I swear to love you a thousand times, a thousand stars. Oh, Jorax, 
So many years lost. We were so foolish. Our hearts are one. No enemy fleet, no sea of stars can ever separate us 